got the social medias, we got the social medias. You got the Facebooks, we got the Facebooks. You got the Twitters, we got the Tweeters. We got the uh, Instagrams, we don't really use that one too much, but you know, we're on there too. If there's something else, we probably got it. You can find them all in the description at the bottom. Hey, welcome back. I'm Brittany, and I'll be your guide to the countdown of the new year. Oh, yeah. You guys ready? Mm. 10, 9, 9 8, 8, 8, 7, 7 6, 6, 5, 4. I'm really excited not, to watch you, her do not this. Gonna, you got to untie that. Two. Two, 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 two and a half. Two and a half. Two, two, and, two and, and quarters. Quarter. Two and quarter. Two and one eighth. Two and one sixteenth. One. one and a half. And one and a half. One and a quarter And then and then so like, and then, and then one eighth. There. Hey! 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 Happy New Year! Hey! Happy New Year! Hey! 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 Be forgetting something about sing. getting high. Wow. Whoa! I don't think that's how New Year's song goes. There's the word "high" is in that song. <laughs> You want a little more? You seem sure, a little sure. less full over there. Do you want me to hold yours so that you can pour it? Yes, please. Mm. Oh, man. So that is my, refreshing. My topic is I want to talk about something very generic. What's your New Year's resolution? Oh, yeah. It's 2020. <clears throat> it's the future. Oh, oh, well, yeah, hold on. We didn't, we didn't oh, clang oh, our we plastic. Didn't, we didn't oh. think about how far apart we all are. I'll use my wingspan to connect it. Thank you. Air, air, air clank. Air clank. There you go. Air clank. I'm going to spill it on my leg, so that's good. So I'm going to go ahead and start this mm. off. Obviously, we just started a podcast. So there you go for a New Year's <laughs> resolution. I, don't, I think like a New Year's resolution would be actually do the podcast. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Maintain velocity of podcast. <laughs> keep, keep podcasts going. We're doing all right. We're already on our second segment of our first episode. Yeah, we're yeah. doing good. Look at us go. Look there at we us. Go. We're people. Um, I spilled a what is essentially like a wet <laughs> dick shape. It looks like you pissed your pants, but just a little bit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like I tried to put it Perfect. away a little too quick and a little. Well, yeah. no, you like just more than a little. Shook more than twice. <laughs> While you were still <laughs> Oh, that's good. I'm doing great today. Um, my New Year's resolution is to not spill. <laughs> Time for a new one. Well, <laughs> Time for yeah. It's okay. It's okay to have it's a my, resolution and make mistakes. It's still 2019. And then keep going. Yeah. Like it's okay to like yeah. make mistakes. It doesn't mean you have to like just keep, just got to keep going is, with your this life. This is my fucking fault because you were like. I, I looked at it and I got huge ogre mitts <laughs> and I was like, that's probably a good amount of uh, champagne. I'm not going to spill that. And then you were like, <laughs> right up to the top, you stupid fuck. Now you have to lean back and try not spill it all over your legs. So it looks like you sort of pissed your pants a little bit. <laughs> um, my New Year's resolution is to look like I slightly pissed my pants less. <laughs> well, you are doing great. Nailed buddy. it. <laughs> Um, I have a couple of New Year's resolutions. Um, like, first of all, I want to play more video games. Yeah. Like, I want to relax more because I feel like I've been, like, going, going, going. And I have not played any new games. Yeah. And I have a huge backlog. Like, I work for a video game company. And at lunch, people are like, what games are you playing? And I'm like, I'm not. And I feel, like, <laughs> super stupid. <laughs> have you played Google Sheets? <laughs> Google it's pretty Sheets. great. Is my favorite it's, game. It's got kind of like a <laughs> steep learning curve, but once you get all the all the oh. different mechanics down. You know, my favorite part of the game is when what? you do the alternating colors, <laughs> and then you. Ooh. Oh, it's so it nice. Makes, <laughs> it makes Minesweeper look like a bitch. My yeah. favorite thing is when you do a pivot table, but you didn't lay out your data right, and it all just breaks, and it, and just it looks fucks up, like yeah. fucking nonsense. I love it. Yeah, I can't well, wait for all the office nerds to enjoy your guys' conversation <laughs> over there. <laughs> But yeah, I just want to like relax more. I think my my goal in 2019 was to work really hard and like push my Etsy shop. Yeah. Um, but now I'm like, it's time to take a break. It's time mm -hmm. to find like a happy medium for that. Um, and then the other thing, uh, I slowly want to start taking better care of myself too. Yeah. Like I have a, a good job now. <clears throat> I want to start going to the doctor, <laughs> and, like going on my doctor's appointments. Yeah. Um, and just like eating better and like just moving more and just doing better. I think that's reasonable. So, yeah. And I'm just trying to do something slow. I don't want to like, 
I mean, we all want to get shredded, but, yeah. you know, I'm just going to be like, let's just take it easy, you know, yeah. and, like, take it slow. But so you could better. get your cheap Mexican steroids, or you could make reasonable life changes. Yeah, I mean, I could always start doing heroin, too. Uh, I mean, that is, that that's is not an option. taking better <laughs> care of yourself, you, though. Are you sure? What if I shoot it up between the toes? Oh, yeah, 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 so the veins don't collapse. Yeah. Yeah, yeah probably. <laughs> that sounds good. That's an option. Um, no, I, I support that. Like, I've... In 2019, I was doing a lot of stuff to try and take better care of myself um, <clears throat> physically. Um, and in 2020, uh, I'm going to be doing a lot of work on my mental health yeah. on top of that. Um, it's like you, you start taking meds and you start like parsing out your own mental health stuff. And you're like, fuck, I didn't realize I was that anxious. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And Holy it's, crap. it's just something that you've lived with for so long, too. Yeah. And you just like... <clears throat> This is just what I had to do to get through it. Yeah. So. And I imagine there are some people who get disheartened when they have like a moment like that. Of, oh, yeah, for sure. It's like the, ah, oh, shit, I, I gained that much weight or mm -hmm. like whatever. But yeah, I mean, it's like continuously moving towards progress is a reasonable thing, Definitely. even if it doesn't feel the most satisfying. Mm -hmm. Like we all wish we could wake up in the morning and just like. Have your press purse. press the swole button mm -hmm. or like uh, do or do just a... like press the have your shit together button <laughs> and like you actually do get up on time and like do all the things yeah. that you meant to do in the morning instead of hitting snooze like three times and being like, Whoa. why do I <laughs> feel like shit? <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, it's not Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, you can't just go to God, the gym I wish it was that would be <laughs> for 30 so much minutes. Easier. Oh, yeah, oh hey, let me just go ride this bicycle around town, I'll be fine. I mean, that is kind of. Was that one of what the one yeah, of the but, things in that game? You could just ride a bicycle. And yeah, and you'd yeah. get you more in shape, or you could eat a lot and you'd get fatter. Wow. Yeah, you'd like San Andreas, I think. Yeah, I've never played it before. I yeah. think the new Red Dead does that stuff too. Though. Does it? I think so. Yeah, but you can only get so fat. Uh, well, like you, <laughs> I yeah, just San get Andreas it. <laughs> didn't have that upper limit. No, you can get. But you could super still run fat. at the oh. exact same speed. Hey man. Oh. You, to, oh. If you're supporting all that weight, you got a lot of muscle. Underneath That's true. That. Does anyone need a refill? I'm. Uh, I, I, you just told me that I need to keep drinking, so yes, here I go. Would yeah. you like more on your pants, sir? I can just pour it yeah, directly just, on this. <laughs> so for my New Year's resolution, uh, I'm going to get a little sappy. Uh, I'm going to try and show more empathy. Mm. Um, I, okay, I'm yeah. really bad about... I've been so <clears throat> much, like, for the last couple of years, I've been just trying to get myself together yeah. and whatnot. That I just like someone will talk to me about their problems. I don't give a fuck. Yeah. <laughs> like, I just like I, I have my own issues. Well, I'm sorry. Like and and there have been times where we've had those conversations mm. where I'm like, I'm frustrated with this work thing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And you're like, uh huh. Okay. And you were just like, God, I wish I had a work thing. <laughs> Fucking idiot. <laughs> well, I mean, I think I've always gave a shit about, like, a few people, but I mean just, like, in general. You meant, like, to people you don't know as well. Yeah, yeah like... I feel like it's easy to I have empathy out. for your friends, but when it's, like, a coworker or, like, a stranger, you're just mm -hmm. kind of, like, glazed over. Like, I want to oh, be empathetic uh -huh. to people I don't like. Yeah, that's the hard one. I got you. Mm -hmm. Like, the people, like, I just... Uh, some There's some people, like, maybe there's, like, you know, people that you have to work with, and I don't mean just coworkers, but, like, projects and whatnot. Yeah. But... <clears throat> Sometimes you just glaze over and you didn't even listen to him. I was just sitting right there. Oh <laughs> no, no, he's good. Shot to the heart. Um, but <laughs> no, I mean, just like <laughs> oh. you love that. Oh man, I love bubbly. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, I I think that's a like a noble goal. And that's, it's noble. Not I don't know about if it'll work. I'm trying. Yeah. Well, I mean, like, <laughs> that's the shit with any self improvement. Is yeah. it's it's gradual. Like yeah. You. And and being aware of it and actively thinking about it is a, a huge step in the right direction. Yeah, like some of that, like if if you're talking about the weird ass emotional baggage that we all have, yeah. or or the years of like learned behaviors that have gotten us to a certain point, mm -hmm. that's really hard to unpack. Yeah, yeah. and mm -hmm. it's not like there's no just, um, cool. I'm just going to tweak this one setting in my brain, and and now uh, there's going to be no clipping, and I'm going to get higher up. <laughs> yeah. Um, are we talking? We're we just going to lower the resolution so we're better at empathy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I mean, shit. I wonder if there's something there. 
Maybe. Well, like, well, I, I, no, seriously, uh, that might be true. I've been, uh, let's, let's put it in computer terms. I'm kind of defragging all of this new experience that yeah. I now have. And all these new operations that I have to do, and I'm allocating room for this new thing that I want to uh, yeah. learn or relearn. Yeah. So, in a way, yes. <clears throat> Sometimes you got to quit Spotify to run the game. Yes. <laughs> mm, true that. <laughs> so, I guess for me, I um, it's it's kind of piggybacking a bit off of uh, you know yours guys is uh, continuing the uh, uh, weight loss because um, mm. that's been the thing I've been doing this year. Um, uh, the focus on uh, mental health and, you know, making sure that my mind's right. That's also a thing that's kind of, you know, it's kind of like 2000, 2019 is when... You tackled a lot of that this yeah, year. Yeah, I got kind of slam dunked by just a whole bunch of shit this year. Um, but uh, it made me a lot more aware of, you know, mental health and, you know, being able to accept that it's okay to, you know, speak to people and um, yeah. get medication that can help you with certain things. Yeah. Um, and before, I'd been kind of deluded by the um, the social stigma that it can cause. So yeah. I think that yeah, e everyone's doing a lot, <clears throat> like, in, you know, everyone that I see are being very positive about mental health, um, you know, uh, you know, uh, I can't, I'm, I'm faltering on the word, yeah. but you know what I mean. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. We're, we're all... Nobody is not fucked up in some way, shape, or form. Mm -hmm. Everyone has something. Everyone has a weird baggage or a, a thing that they think about or something that triggers them, pisses them off, makes them upset. Um, and I think, like, legitimately, I think as dumb meat sacks, our job, part of our job is to improve ourselves mm -hmm. in some way shape or form and i've now i say that i've been really bad at it but i don't think i don't think anyone should be shitty and for the most part like sometimes people are shitty about it like i imagine it's more there if you like quit drinking or something mm -hmm. of like, <laughs> oh you're too good to fall down the stairs with us <laughs> um <laughs> Sorry, I'm just imagining that situation. <laughs> and, like, I imagine there's more negative pressure there. Mm. But I don't I don't think anyone should fucking be a dick bat over someone saying, like, I'm going to try and not be sad all the time. Mm -hmm. Or I'm going to try and deal with my dad issues or what have you. I think, like, most of the, the dickish stuff comes from, like, how you're dealing with it. Yeah. You know, because, like, you can say, like, I don't want to be sad anymore. I'm going to do something about it. And there'll always be people who are like, well, um, it's more if than you sad. take medication, you yeah. are, like, weak or whatever. You should just go for a walk or something like yeah. that. Well, we've know? been dealing with so, that lately ourselves. Yeah. Uh, so that makes sense. For sure. Mm -hmm. Has somebody told you to go take walks? Well, I mean, that's just kind of like a general thing. Like people say, like yeah. if you're like going to therapy or going, or if you're trying to get on medication, yeah. sometimes people will say, "Oh, you don't need to be on like pills and stuff. You need to like go for a walk or do yoga or listen to music or mm -hmm. you know just something." It's like you can do those things too, but don't down this person because they're also trying to take medication. Yeah. Like whatever they're trying to do to like get relief, that's you know. Yeah, I think one one of the biggest everybody. one of the biggest um, mistakes someone can make is like when someone's like freaking out about a thing or in a bad spot is to tell them to calm down. Oh yeah, it's oh, like yeah. well, no well, shit. Like yeah, like the phrase <laughs> "calm down" has never in the history of language made someone calm down. Yeah, <laughs> no, it hasn't. Um, it's me like, and my mom used to get fights over that. We would tell each other to calm down. And just, <laughs> <laughs> I, I totally almost got to fight my brother. Like he told me to calm down when I was mad about something. I was like, motherfucker, it's only gonna make me more mad. You told me to calm down. The opposite effect yeah. too. It's like you cannot even be that uh, that upset about it, and someone tells you to calm down, and then it escalates yeah. because you're like, all of a sudden, I'll this is a thirty-five. You calm. Yeah. I, I'm perfectly <laughs> calm. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Um. I'll, I'll add one more resolution. Uh, I want to travel more. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah! I I got a good bit of it this year because I I went to, we went to Erie mm -hmm. for Zeldathon. That was awesome. That was really cool. Yeah. Um, and I went to Denver uh, to see uh, Dead Mouse at Red Rocks mm. Amphitheater, and that place is awesome. By the way, if anyone's been curious, definitely go check this it out. This part of the conversation brought to you by Red Rocks Amphitheater. <laughs> <laughs> Red Rocks, you owe us money. <laughs> Give me, give Should me. we just send them a bill? This is yeah, yes. for $5. Yeah. Weirdly, this is like the 
second time I've talked about Red Rocks in the last like two days. Oh, really? Is it that cool? Because uh, it it's, seems like it's really cool. Oh, it's really good. Yes, I mean you're 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 for one. So there's not a bad you know place in, you know in the house because it's a huge like amphitheater style. Mm-hmm. Um, so you've always got a good view. You can see Denver in the background, and the lights are just shimmering. It's gorgeous at night. That's cool. Uh, and then you've got b- both rocks flanking you, so it's just the reverb. You know, it's like you're just surrounded by sound. It's just an awesome experience. Getting right. all the yeah. angles of the That's world. Really cool. Yeah, and the uh, the only thing that was a bummer is you have to. So the parking lot is below it so you have to hike basically up a mountain to get there so by the time you're <laughs> up there slightly back down oh oh back down is the best part yeah. yeah but you so you get to the amphitheater and then you have to go up and it's it's just you know get your hiking boots that's all i'm saying so i had a co-worker who was actually there with you what yeah he was at the exact same like concert you were at wow awesome so I, he was i was like I told him, I was like, I've got a friend there. You should hit him up. And then I was like, I just deleted it. I was like, I'm not going to fucking do that. Why yeah. <laughs> hey, I know you're having fun. Add things to your plate. Yeah. He was like, hey, meet this stranger you don't know anything about. So. So, Hutch, where do you want to go? Like, what's 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 your uh, fuck it list for next year? Man, I, I wanted to go to Tokyo. Um, yeah. But, man, it's also Olympics year, and yeah. I would probably go later after that's done, or maybe before. Like you, you, So you went for springtime this yeah. year, right? So yeah. would you recommend it during that time of year? Yeah. So uh, Steph, myself, and a bunch of our friends went – sorry, my lady friend, a bunch of our friends uh, went to Japan in early April, um, and it was really great. Um, it was – spring ish um so we were there we got to see like the tail end of cherry blossom nice thing um which was absolutely beautiful um we went to a couple of of outside walking around areas Mm -hmm. but i think next time i go i'd like to do more of that we we mainly stayed in in cities um yeah so we didn't do like the temple thing Uh that's that's a thing that I'd like to do the next time you go. Did you did you go see a robot? Bam. Oh, we hit fifteen minutes. Aww. Would you guys like to continue this conversation for five more minutes? I just want to know: Did you go see a robot bar? No, we were going to, but we uh, didn't. Darn. Right. Okay. Maybe next time. Well, good. I think that was a pretty good segment then. Yeah. All right. Let's move on to the next one. All right. <laughs>